And so it begins, Johnny Football taking over Cleveland as Browns training camp begins tomorrow. There is Manziel as today the Browns held a conditioning session and I'm here to tell you Johnny Football is in shape even after that exciting summer that he had. Hi everybody, Dave Chodowski live with you in Berea as we're looking forward to one of if not the most anticipated Browns training camp since they returned in 1999. Here's what's going on today. As I mentioned, the Browns held a conditioning session. Everyone in good shape except Phil Taylor did not make it through, but let's talk about the storylines. And I think the biggest one, would you say, is the quarterback situation? Yeah, Manziel. I mean, all the jerseys he sold and all the social media hype going up against the hometown kid who gave the fans hope last season. So it's going to be a battle, everybody. But for now, Hoyer is the starter. Yeah, I just kind of want to come in and, you know, play the best I can and, and kind of establish myself as a leader on this team and, and go from there. I think uh, I've always said, you know, ever since I took over last year that I felt like this was my team and uh, unfortunately the injury happened, but I want to reestablish that and, and just prove to my teammates and coaches that I'm, I'm back and ready to go. They definitely drafted me with an idea of what my skills were and what some of my weaknesses were. So for me, I think uh, Continuing, they're continuing to adapt a little bit to me, and I'm continuing to adapt a little to them. It's it's both, but I'm continuing to try and get better as an all-around quarterback. Next up on the storyline train, it has to be Josh Gordon. He is here today as he took part of conditioning. He'll have that appeal on August 1st. Mike Pettin said that, hey, they are going as far as Gordon will go until they find out any differently. They expect him to be on the field. But what do the Browns do without him? You got Nate Burleson, Miles Austin, Andrew Hawkins. Someone has to step up. How about the running game? Last year, it was terrible. You know, the whole Trent Richardson deal. Ben Tate, the big offseason signing. He's considered the guy. But then they drafted Terrence West in the third round so it's going to be a major battle to watch along with Deion Lewis. How about on defense now? Everyone expecting that defense to be so much better and Justin Gilbert the eighth overall pick. I mean the Browns passed on Sammy Watkins traded down to get him. They need him to solidify that corner opposite Hayden. In my mind he has to be the starter in week one. Let's move to baseball now. Indians and Royals again tonight after taking the first three against the Tigers on this road trip. The Indians now four and four on the trip, so that's almost wasted all those wins against the Tigers. How about last night? What a game that was. So wild. Indians lost two to one in 14 innings. Wasted the gem by Corey Kluber. Perfect game into the seventh inning. Eight outs away, but it's this play that everyone's talking about in the eighth inning. Mike Moustakis. I mean, Ryan Rayburn, good effort. I think you got to catch that ball, but then what happened here? What? What is that? I mean, he spiked the ball into the ground. Oh, man, that allows the first run to score and really cost the Indians the ball game. I mean, Rayburn, what's up, dude? He definitely didn't deserve to uh, get the loss. And at the time, you know, that's all I could think about, you know, um, you know, trying to make a play on him and didn't quite come up with it for that to happen. You know, that was a, that was a tough one to swallow. Um, but my teammates were able to pick me up and, you know, get a run there in the ninth. And uh, just unfortunately, we couldn't pull it out. All right, the Indians are seven and a half back. First pitch at 8-10 back here in Berea. Mike Pettin is talking right now, and we're going to hear from Brian Hoyer and Johnny Manziel coming up. We'll have more at 7 o'clock. Dave Chodowski in Berea, back to you guys in the studio. All right.